Hey, welcome back. Uh, this is the Project Civic, uh, and we'll be looking to put a rear um, sway bar in. To do that, we need to swap over the arms to ones with uh, sway bar links in. So these are off a um, DC2 Integra, and I've just given them a quick coat of paint. And then I've got this, which is a um, is a subframe brace. I wasn't keen on going the arms, um, the kind of knockoff arms, but I think the brace is okay. It just uh, stops the uh, subframe twisting. So this one I got from um, AliExpress. Uh, and it actually looks all right. Uh, so I guess we'll pull it out and have a look. This is what the um, Chinese brace came with. Uh, a couple of the bits that go on the back. It's straight off the mill by the looks of it. Uh, and a bag of the hardware. So this goes uh, up underneath up underneath the car. Uh, you probably can't see it, but in that uh, across there, in that, in that subframe. So the brace sits across here, we just have to take out this bolt and the other one on the other side. So I'll do that and then we can uh, start bolting it up. So the brace will sit like that on the car. Um, just trying to work out which bolts are best to put in first, probably that top one or something I think. So we've put two bolts in here. Uh, we've used a longer bolt on the bottom one. So there's three different size bolts and I've used uh, the longer one of the, sorry, the kind of middle size one of the three um, in there. The smaller one on the top. So I did one side, uh, that side first, just so I could work out how it goes. Uh, basically these bits have to slip in uh, behind and they will sit over the nut and then I don't know if you can see that um, but the that sits in there nicely and the bolt pokes out so you just have to put a nut on the end of that bolt and then it all tightens up so these are the lower control arms I'm swapping them over from the EG without a sway bar to the DC2 which has the sway bar link uh, the other interesting thing is that these are both left hand left hand ones uh, but they they bend different ways so you can see there I don't think it'll make a difference but it's just a bit interesting uh, so we'll bolt these ones in as well so one thing I found is that the bolt is actually the wrong thread pitch this is a 1.5 on this is on the ma main bolt that goes across into the lower control arm so I went to my local bolt place and got a uh, 110 long M10 1.25 um, and while I was there I thought stuff it I may as well get the rest of the um, fittings they're pretty ordinary in the kits that come um, so I'd recommend at least checking that you've got the right stuff with your kit before you put it on um, and maybe even upgrading it to the to some local you know good quality hardware so I bolted it in with the new hardware I uh, didn't get these bolts, um, but I actually had to uh, trim the back of one of these screws off because uh, it was making it uh, not align. And now you can see um, it all aligns up pretty, pretty well. So we'll go and put the lower control arms back in and then we'll uh, tighten it all up. That's it. Complete now. Um, I've left these, those three loose and I'll drop it down on the ground before I do those up but yeah that's it a little bit longer than I would have thought um, mainly due to how things fitted and having to get parts and that but for 50 bucks you can't complain you know it's not going to be perfect I guess but uh, it fits alright
Oh, my God.